After starting the beginning part of their season on the road, the Husky softball team is finally back home to so took on Army West Point here at Burrell Family Field. It was a breezy, overcast day here in stores, and both teams knew that playing small ball would be crucial to finding victory here today. After a scoreless opening frame, it was Lexi Hastings getting things going for the Huskies, getting a single and then stealing second immediately afterwards. Olivia Sappington would then drive the ball up the middle for an RBI single to get UConn on the board 1-0. In the field, the Huskies made a few great plays to help out pitcher Mary Beth Olsen, including a nifty play by shortstop Rihanna Marcelino, catching the line drive and then tagging the runner at second. Back-to-back -back doubles from Garcia and Sanded would then give the Huskies a 2-0 advantage. In the fourth inning, the script would begin to flip, as Army would lead off the inning with a single, who would then reach second following a wild pitch. A single down the line by Maddie Wilkes would cut the lead down to one, then a couple batters later, Army would tie the game with another RBI single, going down the right field line. Army was not done, however, as they would successfully pull off a suicide squeeze to give them their first lead of the game. Elisa Fulski would come in the pitch and get the Huskies out of the jam, but a couple innings later, Army would strike again on an RBI double to take a 4-2 lead. Down two runs, the Huskies needed a spark, and Olivia Sappington provided that with a shot over the right field fence to cut the lead down to one. With their backs against the wall in the bottom of the seventh, Brianna Marcelino fueled the comeback with a double down the line, and Guerrero would move her over to third with a single. Sack fly would bring home the equalizer, but Jonna Sennon said enough was enough, getting a walk-off RBI single to give the Huskies the come-from-behind walk-off victory, 5-4. It was a crazy turn of events here today as the Huskies pulled off the come-from-behind victory, but they are just getting started as they are welcoming in the Paul University for fellow Big East foe for a three-game series this weekend. From Braille Family Field, I'm Tyler Kent, UCTV Sports.